So, first of all, there is a long process of learning inside the group itself. Yes. The next stage is that we try inside these groups after they've learned inside the groups, like in a classroom. Don't even call them a group yet. It's a classroom. That in these classrooms, there start to be interconnections between them. So these groups, more correctly, they divide into tens. Tens meaning what? Ten people in a group, and they try to examine this on themselves. Can they connect? What should we examine? The measure to which you can think to the benefit of each other. Okay, and suppose that we, we can to some extent, so you continue. But when does that stage, when you start integrating the different groups, when does that come? In the meantime, it's only happening inside the groups. So we first of all have to reach the level where people think favorably about each other. Yes. After this, when does the stage that we can start integrating the two groups, when does that come? When every group becomes as a person, as one person. What do you mean? That in their connection, they'll become as one. That they'll become as one in the one group, and they'll connect in the other group, and will also become as one. And then I can start bringing them together, because they've already learned inside their groups how each of them has to annul himself in order to connect with the others. So, in conceding himself, he already learned how to do it, and now every group, as one, can annul itself, concede itself, in order to connect with the other group. And then they start merging and connecting in order to build a third thing. So what connects them is actually the method. It's no longer the culture, history, values, ideology, but the method itself that everyone's implementing between them. This is actually what helps them connect. It's like we're all learning a certain language and suddenly we all start speaking the same language. And it's a completely new language. Yes. Unfortunately, our time's up. Dr. Leitman, education for peace. What's the most important thing that I should remember for it to succeed? First of all, to know that we have no choice, but to approach something completely new, and there we will get a new life.